Hey ladies and gentlemen, this is Adrian Broussard with It's Me Technology Firm and today I want to talk a little bit about uh, a new Wi-Fi system that I found has been really really helpful. So I know a lot of you out here, you probably have a modem and a router and your router uh, gives you Wi-Fi and all that kind of stuff but there's a new system out here that's making things so much easier. I can't even begin to explain, especially on the home front. Uh, it can get a little complicated if you have a uh, business because uh, you can actually use this for some small businesses and stuff like that. But mainly uh, in the home arena, it is so, so simple. So you may have heard some of the big names like Linksys, Belkin, D-Link. All of these are big brand name routers. Uh, you know the Nighthawk series all these different and they're, they're great routers you know but in homes that like we have today and in small businesses the problem we face is you run into a spot that is dead and you can't get connectivity you know or it reaches not to, it doesn't reach to the back of the house you know or the back of the business so they've made this new system and it is absolutely awesome so I'm not going to go into all the technical details and terms. I'm pretty sure there's many other videos out there that goes into that kind of stuff. I'm going to give it to you from a, you know, not an IT standpoint, but just from a personal standpoint. Just someone who knows about IT to someone who may not know a whole lot. So to get right into it, so the system is called Eero, E-E-R-O, all right? And this is one of the Eero access points. All right. So the difference is, so with a normal router, you would have your router and let's say uh, it would be at the front or the back of your house and it doesn't reach the whole area. So what you would typically do is you would go out, you would buy an extender you replace that extender you know in the area to try to repeat that signal now some people know this some people don't but when you leave the main area you go to the area with the extender a lot of times you actually have to connect to the extender it doesn't always just take that signal and transfer it over so so there's some systems that do there's some systems that don't but I'm finding a lot of people at least down here where I'm at they don't so the Eero takes care of that. It's all seamless. So you take one of these, you set it up, and the setup is uh, incredibly easy for, for home. Now, I can tell you if you're a Bell South customer, it is a little bit more challenging. That's not due to the fault of the Eero system because the Eero system itself is not hard at all. But the challenges of your ISP make it a little bit more challenging. And it's not, um, it's not that anybody's doing anything wrong, you just have to know the proper settings and things to change to be able to get it to work. Um, it's just not as simple as plug and play as it is with Cox and some of the other ISPs. So once again, not anything wrong, it's just different. So a little bit more challenging. But once you get this system hooks up, hooked up, it is so much easier. And we found that it clears up dead spots, okay? And it, the reach is about 40 feet. And the, the great thing is you can daisy chain and you can continuously add more and more as you want to daisy chain further and further, okay? Now there, there is a degradation on it uh, to a degree, but you can also help that by also running a cable, a hard line, or hard ethernet into one of these ports okay so and we'll get further into that into another video but I want to keep this very easy in general so pro number one you don't have to connect to an extender when you go into a different room that's pro number one pro number two I don't know how many of you know that uh, the new routers and stuff like that come with two channels or three channels right they come with a 2.4 gigahertz and a 5 gigahertz channel and some have one 2.4 and two 5 gigahertz channel well on the Eero system it doesn't actually present you with all those different channels when you connect uh, 
internally it's smart enough to know whether your device is capable of running 5 gigahertz or 2.4 gigahertz and it will just deliver that to you so there's no more having to worry about am I connected to the right one am I getting the best speed um, and if you don't know yes if you connect to a 5 gigahertz channel on Wi-Fi versus a 2.4 you will get faster speeds but the limitation is that the 5 gigahertz channel is a lot uh, not a lot but uh, the range on it is less than the 2.4 so that does begin become the uh, it does happen to be a problem at times so but with this you don't really have to worry about it and if it does come to be a problem you just get another one and add it to the system and I'm gonna tell you we have had no hiccups no problems as far as streaming uh, the the buffers and stuff that we used to see they've gone away you know we can stream four five six different devices and this thing is holding true we're not having a problem on any of them so I just want to kind of give you guys uh, a heads up um, you can check them out now they're a little bit more expensive than your typical solutions um, at least when you start getting into the multiple because it's 200 for the first one it's um, and then a hundred dollars every one after that so there's a one two and three pack so the first pack 200 two pack 300 three pack 400 so but anyway um once again the Eero system just want you guys to be able to check it out and it is an awesome system and I am not getting paid for this so I'm here just trying to bring you some uh, decent quality products and if you have any questions about it you can call us at 504-383-3259 or check us out on our website at www.ittsme.com